Hi there, this is Robert Simon from Warboard again and in this short video I would like to show you a solution that we are delivering to Benu Serbia. Uh, this is a pharmacy uh, chain and they would like to install digital signage screens looking at the customers and I will be the uh, pharmacist in this uh, use case so I am behind the table and uh, Benu want to communicate to the, uh, to the actual customers and uh, they would like to uh, offer suggested products related to the actual purchase. So let's say that there is no one at the screen. Uh, here you can see uh, the cash register device which is also using our digital signage interface right now. Um, it is empty and the next uh, customer is coming. There is a general uh, signage communication right now, uh, only a loop uh, playing uh, an image gallery and when the next customer uh, arrives and gives the product uh, he or she is about to buy, the pharmacist takes it and reads the product code. Then the information on the cash register device is updated. You can see that what is the product uh, he or she is about to buy. And this information also delivered to the digital signage screen. So you can see that Otrivin is the product. Uh, this is the list of items. What is this? Uh, uh, total amount, etc. And what is the uh, suggested uh, product? So people are buying uh, Otrivin, they also buy uh, Celascon or whatever uh, together with this product. When the next product is, is uh, read, then this information appears here, this information is delivered there and uh, we can also uh, display a suggested product. If you take a look at my screen, everything is connected to a, a, a Google Sheet. In that Google Sheet, we have the product codes, the name, and all the information that is, uh, uh, that is required for this uh, integration is coming from this, let's say, database. This is the easiest way to, to demonstrate it, but it can be also uh, some kind of database connection, so price, image, uh, location reference code and you can see also the column G and H that there are reference code for males and females. It is because here in front of me we are using a, a, a very small AI camera that is also looking at the customer but in this case it is looking at me and it is blinking blue when there is a male in front of the, uh, that AI camera so the distance is about one, one and a half meters, and it's going to be red, and you can see also the signal in the corner when there is a, a female in front of the camera. So again, there is a male, then for the dotri nitsin, dotri nitsin, you see this mashka, uh, uh, yes, yeah, the, the, the face mask uh, advertisement, and when there is a female in front of the in front of the camera and I read the same code, it will display aspirin uh, for females. So different suggestions for, for males and females. This small AI camera can not only do the, uh, the gender detection, but it is also doing age detection. We have set up five categories like kids, young, junior, uh, adult and nature and we will report it, uh, the category, all together with the, uh, with the other uh, events and you can fine tune your search with this additional information. So with this solution we can give a much more precise and targeted uh, upsell solution for a pharmacy network like Bennu uh, and it doesn't use anything else, just a small AI camera and Volbor digital signage screen and some kind of customization of course, but it can be uh, done within a um, couple of hours. Um, again, let's play everything from the scratch. So the cart is empty. Uh, when, when it is empty, it, uh, the screen is playing uh, general digital signage, loop content, videos, images, etc. The first custom, uh, the customer arrives to the uh, pharmacist. The pharmacist is reading the code. Dotrecitin, I will never learn, to learn these names. It is there, it is delivered there. There is a suggested product. And when I am as a good customer in front of the 
uh, the angle of the, the camera, then it is showing a, a blue signal, which means that I am a male. If there would be a female, then it, it would show a red signal, which means that there is a female. The pharmacist is reading the next product and reading the next product. The information is always delivered to the uh, sign it screen and it is suggesting uh, related product. Uh, to the actual item. Also in this uh, Google sheet, we categorize the product. So this is the category A, B and C, and you can also suggest category related products. And let's take a look at the content editor or the Volboard interface. Here you can see that under this account, I just have these two uh, devices, the, the uh, customer from device and the pharmacist uh, device. I have a couple of loops for the advertisement videos, images, etc., And we are just using these two uh, contents. The sender is the, the cash register. And uh, this is the content that you can see uh, here on the uh, customer facing uh, device. It is just uh, put together of components that you might uh, know from Walbert system by default. So this is what I wanted to show you in a couple of minutes. Of course, if you had any questions, just please contact us and we are happy to give you more and detailed information. Thank you very much and have a nice day.